Hello, this is Ute from Ute Silver Witch Corner. And what are we doing today? I put it in this camera. Organic dandelion honey. Can you see? Whoops, can you see that? Okay. Um, as I promised you, I want to make a little bit of information about my organic um, dandelion honey because I'm just using the first batch from the dandelions. So, and it's over now. They are all yeah dying and flying away so it's hardly to get any fresh dandelions they are coming back but i always use just the first dandelions they are coming out because they are the youngest and they are delicious and i feel these are the right dandelions to use for our honey honey that means it's not from the bees it's honey um, I made, and you see pictures, I made out of the flowers and just the flowers and you have to heat them up in, no, first you have to put them in a, in a pot and then let them soak in water so all the little uh, animals are getting out and then you boil it for a certain amount of time and then you let it sit overnight and after this you and you see all the pictures here and after this what i'm doing is um the next day um oh i forgot i put yeah one lemon uh, has to go in there as well so and after the 24 hours you take all the dandelions and yeah take a uh a, 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 a towel a nice clean towel and you put all the dandelion flowers and the lemons and put them in this towel and wring it out and do it really hard so all the goodiness is fall is going into a pot so and in this pot then there is brown sugar and it's one to one so that means if you have one liter um of dandelion i want to say tea because it's first what what you have is more or less a tea and then you have one to one so that means one liter of this tea equals one part of brown sugar so one liter one kilo one liter two liter two kilo so it is a lot it's a lot a lot a lot and it's extremely sweet but delicious and healthy um so if you on a diet and um, then i would say mm, no it has too much calories um as i said because it's the dandelion i want to say tea and the the sugar and the lemon and then when this is done you have to let it boil for pff, it depends on three hours four hours it depends on because it takes a long time until it's getting a little bit thick it will never ever be thick as the honey you can buy in the store that's why i say it's more um dandelion honey slash syrup so you can put it on pancakes or you put it on a toast a toast bread but it's net never ever so thick as the honey you buy in the store um i could make it thicker but then i have to put any additional stuff into the honey and that's what i don't want to do because then it's like um, if you want to make more uh, jam or such you can use the same ingredients to make it really thick but i don't want to do that because I, I want that the taste is still there from, from the dandelions and yeah, of course, <laughs> brown sugar, but this is what it is. So, and just to remind you, <clears throat> the dandelions is a real wonder herb. And as you know already, I love, 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 love my dandelions. And right now it's the busiest time of the year because at the same time, the buckleweed is growing over our yard front yard and backyard and i have to also go ahead and harvest my buckleweed to make buckleweed teas or creams or tinctures and this has to be dry like the dandelion when i make other stuff the dandelion honey is made out of fresh dandelion flowers and the creams and the tinctures or the oils i can use them fresh or dried but for the tea it's definitely dry so my dryer for the herbs is in the last couple of days or weeks um 
running and running and running and running. So the dandelions are dry and then I put the buckwheat in. So and it's just over and over. And then I have to dry the leaves from the dandelions and the roots from the dandelions. So it's right now it's running. So I guess our power bill will be a little bit higher, but it's dandelion time. <laughs> so as I said, as I said, dandelion for most of you, it's really a weed. Um, when I talked to the new neighbors we have and I said um, last year before you bought the house I was allowed to harvest the dandelions and I just want to ask if I can do this since you are the new owner and he said to me what the wheat over there nah, you can have it I said okay <laughs> so it is wheat for anybody who is not interested or is not an herbalist or don't know me but it is yeah it is a wheat but it's also a medical plant for me, for the herbalist, for us. <laughs> it's not a weed. So, and, and I don't understand how you can say it's a weed when you know or you hear what beautiful stuff you can do out of the dandelions. But okay, people are still learning. So, and dandelion, it doesn't matter how, even the honey has the same... Um, benefits for your health. I mean, you can take a spoon or put it in your tea. Um, it helps against uh, indigestion, loss of appetite and UTE tract. So because dandelion, it doesn't matter how you take the dandelion in all the different ways. We uh, have it in our product line for you. Um, it's the the global thing from dandelion is diuretic that has that has <laughs> that makes you pee so and that's the main thing from dandelions as you know there are tons of benefits um for all the herbs and as well for the dandelions um for example it's dandelion is rich on vitamin c a k e iron magnesium and potassium so and just in this little, whoops, in this little flower, um, there are so many um, vitamins and, and good things for you. Even the traditional Chinese and Native American medicine, dandelion root, for example, has long been used to treat stomach and liver conditions. Um, today, we as a herbalist believe that it can aid in the treatment of many ailments, included acne, eczema, high cholesterol, heartburn, <laughs> heartburn, and any uh, gastrointestinal disorder, diabetes, or even cancer. So in our product line, as you, I'm sure you know already, we have dandelion capsules, dandelion oil, dandelion cream, dandelion lip balm, and again, just from this year, and if it's done, it's done because I don't have any dandelion. If all the products are made, I want to make and I did make it already with my fresh dandelions, then it's done um, because I want the fresh dandelions. I don't want to uh, get them from somewhere else. I mean, you can I'm sure you can buy them in any herbal wholesale store, but not the flowers. So, as I said, we have dandelion lip balm again this year and we have the organic dandelion honey slash syrup so a lot and if you are interested in more information from all the herbs we have please like and subscribe to our youtube channel all right um we have the first batch and the first batch of uh, tea is already packed and i have another one here right now in the dryer for, for another batch of tea and uh, we will be at the farmer's market the 1st of June from 8 to 12 or 8 to noon. And we will, as I said in an earlier video, we are not on the top as you used to it for the last four years or five years. This year we are on the bottom. So before you go up the stairs and yeah, you see us because we are big <laughs> and we want to make sure we have everything what you like um, with us at the farmer's market and if you are saying I want it now I want it now before it's gone um, <laughs> then you can go ahead and visit us in our beautiful shop here or you shoot me a message so we are here for you we are growing with you all right and again even we are talking about honey 
Ta-da! <laughs> I'm your master herbalist. I'm not a doctor and I cannot and I will not never ever give you any medical advice. What we are sharing here is our own experience, the experience from family, friends, customer and all right. And yeah, I guess that's for today, for today's dandelion, honey, organic honey, honey and the explanation how I'm doing that. So may you want to try it on your own. But you have to hurry up because the dandelions are nearly done. <laughs> All right. That's the video for today. Um, as you know, every weekend we will bring out new videos for you so you can read and learn about all of our herbs. And yeah, I would say that's it. Bye bye. Ciao, ciao. Love and light. That was Ute from Ute's Herbal Witch Corner. <coughs> the end.